Hi friends, welcome to SQLServerLog.com. Uh, today in this video we are going to see uh, a very important function, SQL IIF function, SQL if function. So basically IIF function is a shorthand way for writing a case expression. If you have used case in SQL Server, so you'll be like very happy to know this um, if function. Uh, which you can use into your queries basically it evaluates boolean expression uh, passed as the first argument and true value is written if the boolean expression is true and false value is written if the boolean expression is false so basically it evaluates a condition and gives you true or false output so I'll show you in SQL Server Management Studio uh, by a few examples so here I have written a uh, few examples so basically syntax for this is IIF this SQL function into bracket boolean expression you have to pass and if this condition is true you will get the true value as output if boolean expression is false you will get the false value as output so condition will be evaluated in uh, IIF function and you will get the true or false as output for example in this condition I am selecting select command IIF function into bracket 100 is less than 500 if this condition is true then output will be true if this condition is false if this condition is false then output output will be false okay so I will uh, run it we know very well 100 is less than 500 which is correct okay so you'll get the output as true similarly in example 2 I'm writing select I have function 100 is less than 500 which is you know very well which is correct 100 is less than 500 so if it this condition is correct you'll get output as 1 else 0 so I'll run it so you'll get the output as 1 similarly in example 3 I'm taking Two variables num1 and num2 and I'm giving num1 as 100 and num2 as 200 and I'm just selecting if function I have function if num1 is greater than or equal to num2 okay so this value 100 at the place of num1 100 is greater than or equal to 200 if this condition is true then give the output as pass else give the output as fail okay so we know very well 100 is not greater than or equal to 200 so I'll get the output as fail okay I'll just run it so output is fail similarly in example 4 okay I'm taking variable as at the red student where care 100 and student name is Rocky and I'm uh, writing select I have condition at the red student in a student in condition I'm using here and uh, two students are there Rocky and John okay in if condition this is first expression okay if this condition is true then my output should come as favorite subject is maths else if condition is false this then uh, output should come as favorite subject is science so here you can see I am selecting a student okay and I have given student name as Rocky this Rocky name is available in this condition which means condition is true so if the condition is true then first result will come okay so I, I'll just execute it favorite subject is maths so similarly in this way you can uh, write your queries uh, in different different uh, condition you can use in your SQL survey as per business requirements so I hope you will like this video thank you very much